the climate clock shows the time we have left to change our actions until irreversible change according to the clock we have 6 years 126 days 32 minutes and 10 seconds to change and slowly reduce our carbon emissions this graph represents the number of emissions and their effect on temperatures rising here on the bottom right it shows what will be the catastrophic effects if temperatures increase the creators of this magnificent clock are gan golin and andrew boyd in an interview with ted alexandro they mentioned something important to note You know the media loves to be sensationalist and say this is a doomsday clock like you know it's counting down and in 7 years the world is going to explode that's not what the clock shows right it is showing our time window for action this is yeah. the best period of time that we have to really make a difference um and the world will go to later but it's will be because <laughs> of what we do now and so we sort of think of it like if you were driving really fast towards a cliff you cannot hit the brakes at the last minute you have to hit the brakes long before that and the sooner you hit the brakes and the more you slow down you may actually never go off the cliff in fact you could maybe even turn around and go in a totally different direction and so that's what we're saying the 7 years is the critical moment where what we do makes a difference now it would have been better to hit the brakes 30 years ago right but you know like they say the best time to plant a tree 30 years ago when's the second best time right now the problem is that most countries are not taking actions and have not implemented a proper plan all nations worldwide need to aim to be carbon free by 2050 and if this is not achieved we will cross the 1.5 degree mark countries like india pakistan the uae and china do not aim to be carbon free or have not developed a proper plan for it This makes other nations carbon neutral plans useless. We need global cooperation. Because if one country, especially huge countries like India, China and UAE, don't cooperate, everyone could be affected. This graph shows us what happens if we are carbon free worldwide by 2050. The climate clock is our wake up call. for change and action if we don't do anything and the government doesn't address anything our lives will change for the worse slowly but surely visit our website to learn how you can live a sustainable life join events and protect the environment in the UAE and click here to explore the benefits of living zero waste